55, every U.S. coast will experience rapidly increasing high tide floods thanks to something called moon wobble and climate change, according to a new report from Massa. Sarah Costa explains what exactly moon wobble is and what was found in that recent NASA study. Almost all U.S. mainland coastlines, in addition to Hawaii and Guam, could see record high tide flooding in the 2030s thanks to what is known as moon wobble. But what is moon wobble? Moon wobbles aren't new according to NASA. They are a cyclical shift in the moon's orbit every 18.6 years, and they've been recorded since 1728. The wobble affects the moon's gravitational pull and can either suppress or amplify ocean tides on Earth. In half the moon's 18.6 year cycle, Earth's regular daily tides are suppressed. High tides are lower than normal, and low tides are higher than normal, according to NASA. Around the mid-2030s, locations along the Pacific and Gulf of Mexico coastlines will experience rapid increases in high tide flooding frequency, according to the NASA study. The Gulf of Mexico coastlines were specifically mentioned as an area of concern because they are, quote, more vulnerable to sea level rise due to relatively narrow sea level distributions. The floods will sometimes occur in clusters lasting a month or longer, depending on the positions of the moon, earth and sun, according to the JPL news article. Low lying areas near sea level are increasingly at risk and suffering due to the increased flooding, and it will only get worse, said a NASA administrator. Compared to hurricane storm surges, high tide floods only involve a small amount of water. But if it floods 10 or 15 times a month, a business can't keep operating with its parking lot underwater. One of the lead researchers explained, so you could read the full study from NASA on KSAT.com right now. I'm Sarah Costa, KSAT 12 News.